Hi, this is Lisa from Telios Tutors, and in this video I'm going to take you through some of our features from our online interactive whiteboard for private tutoring. So on this screen, what you will see as a student, um, whatever I'm doing, you'll be able to see it as well. Um, and that's just for this whiteboard, so nothing else that I'm doing, but because we are going to be sharing the same link, um, whatever I do within the whiteboard is going to show up in your screen as well. So in, that also includes my um, uh, movement of my mouse. So for example, how I'm moving my mouse now, this is what you'll see on your screen, exactly the same thing. Okay, um, and likewise, whatever you write on the whiteboard um, and do, including the mouse, um, I'll also see as well. So at the moment you're seeing my screen, if I'd like to upload a PDF file, let's say we're conducting uh, an English comprehension uh, text uh, lesson over here, um, I may want to drag to make this larger or smaller. And this doesn't change or distort the quality of the text either, which is really good. Also, you can rotate the text if you wish. And on the next page, I'm going to show you one of our students' homework, which was sent over to me and uh, once again I'm just going to drag from my laptop or computer into the whiteboard and this is a photo of um, one of our students homework so once again I can just enlarge um, and then I can make some comments if I wish to so um, I may want to write something like well done yeah so I may want to just handwrite that or I can actually type this um, and I can select some colors from this palette as well so I can click on this T and just make some comments or, you know, write some tips for improvement. So many things you can do on here and I can click the pen um, and the ruler as well. Uh, I can underline certain words if I need to. And I can also uh, on the left show you um, this this section here where all of our uploaded files um, are uploaded. and. Over here, there's an option to select your different backgrounds and grids, uh, so different colors, etc. Um, over here, we have a call. So we can do either a video conferencing or just a normal phone call. Um, and that allows us to connect with each other by voice and video. So over here, there's a chat box. If you wish to speak to your tutor, you can just communicate um, like a messenger. Uh, but typically, the voice and video conferencing is actually sufficient. And then over here, um, you can also, actually, let's have a look at over here. So there's a rubber here, so you can actually rub things out if you wish. And over here, if you click on this pan, you just click on the page and just slide it up and down if you need to. And then let's do another page. Imagine if I'm conducting a maths lesson. Um, there's many shapes that you can select from over here, as you can see. There's many symbols and shapes. Uh, and images as well so that's quite good um, so let's say I'd like to select a cylinder I'm just going to just literally just drag and it will just create one for me very simply um, and if I need to let's say um, draw a line it even tells me the degrees a bit straight um, some arrows so let's say one of the questions I wanted to ask my student was to calculate the volume of this cylinder I can just type that here very easily so calculate the volume of this cylinder and then just click done and then if you need any symbols you can also click on here so there's plenty of symbols to select from you can change the size of the text uh, as well um, and it's as simple as that um, I hope that you found this video useful um, the good thing about this as well is that um, you don't need to save this manually Every time you click on this link, you and your tutor can access it anytime, anywhere, um, and you can just revisit whenever you need to. I hope this helps.